Welcome to the COP TV, the voice of football's most famous stand. Right, hello there everyone, welcome back to the COP TV, Liverpool 3, Norwich 1, what are we saying lads? Yeah, good performance, I mean like, first half, we could have scored about four or five goals, I mean, like, we looked solid, we just couldn't get the finishing product, obviously we had the offside goal, had a uh, clearance or two off the line, Simicast had a, nearly had one, Mo was, Mo was electric the whole game, you know, every single time was cutting inside, Brandon Williams fucking manx scum, <laughs> you know, <laughs> getting done all over the gap, yeah, yeah, tearing him apart, I thought he would have got sent off after that first booking, I was thinking, ah, oh, the second half, Mo's going to tear him apart, he's going to take him down, yeah, unfortunately he didn't, but, uh, yeah. let me know what you're saying about this, in the first half, I thought the main issue was the midfield, I thought they were losing yeah. possession a little bit too much, getting overran a little bit too much, but then where it went into our favour, and where you've actually got to say, Klopp had a masterclass, the offsides, I want to know what you're thinking, I haven't asked anyone this question, today so I'm looking forward to your answer when you think about the way that we defend it can be very worrying at times because it's going to get a few chances in behind but it's working they were offside about 10 times yeah. today and it's the same as against Burnley as well it's the same thing yeah, man. you know we play a high line but yeah. like we all worry oh my god they're throwing goal yeah. they're offside yeah. like 90% of the time they're offside yeah. and if not you saw what happened with Dzeko the other night yeah. Van Dijk catches up Van Dijk's yeah. rapid Van Dijk will catch up to anyone yeah. he's stronger but push everyone off the ball so it doesn't matter with that high line because Van Dijk we know Van Dijk can catch up it's a few moments where a few of the passes the sloppy one that was Joe Gomez recovered one early uh, in the second half where I was scared because I think there was two missed, missed passes because we played such a high line it would have let them go through luckily Joe Gomez was there but yeah I think I think the way we defend it works so well and that teams you know teams think that, oh yeah we're through on goal but it's not because they're offside. Absolutely, lads. And you know what? You mentioned one player there, Van Dijk. I feel like this season he's had a lot of, you know, slack, a lot of criticism. Oh, he's not the same as what he was before. Oh, he's back, he, he's even even without 20%, though, he's still the best centre back in the league. But over the past few games, I really do feel like he has been slowly and, it, you know, securely getting back to his best. Is that just something that I'm seeing, or do you think oh, other fans are seeing it now? And against Milan as well. Again, him and Canate and Milan were. were or he was the man of the match against Milan. Yeah, I agree, I agree. I said him, him and Canate are unbelievable. And today he was solid as well. Um, Commands really well, and again, and again, like I said, with Milan, he didn't. Klopp did the same thing with the substitutions, yeah. made substitutions in midfield, did again, did it again the same today, and it changed the game completely. As soon as them substitutes come on, we get the goals, the the crowd gets rising, and yeah, we win the game. It was boss lads. What did you, last thing before we go? We've obviously got a final on Sunday. The atmosphere was a little bit better towards the end of the day. I feel like that's going to create a good momentum going into the final. What do you see that going like? Yeah, I mean. Leeds, we know they've got a good away fan, so I think Leeds is going to be, hopefully, if we get the atmosphere booming for that, then it leads to Sunday. And obviously, Sunday, we're going to take over Wembley. I like that. I like that very much. Tuesday, on the Liverpool YouTube and Twitch, I'm going to be playing FIFA, so E Premier League on the Liverpool. Ah, get onto Twitch and watch and play FIFA. I'll beat you on FIFA, though. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you all later. Whoa, 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 whoa. Just before you go, don't forget, give us a like, drop us a comment, and subscribe to the Cock TV. The voice of football's most famous stand.